Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. I would really like you to not report me to the cops. Uh, I'm going to need you to not. <laughs> I'm going to take this cart. All right. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Blender Arthur is amazing. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. <laughs> <laughs> I've never ridden a cart as Slender Arthur before. This is beautiful. Uh, I do hope you all enjoy this episode. We're going to be playing some Red Dead Redemption 2 as the most terrifying version of Arthur that can ever be made. It's Slender Arthur. This is what he's been dubbed. <laughs> and if you've never seen this... Whoa! His head almost flew off of his body. Good lord. Uh, this is something that you can create when messing around. <laughs> his feet. I always forget. He looks like he's got giant clown shoes on. Um, but yeah, this is Slender Arthur. His head bobs back and forth when he runs. His arms are all sorts of funky. And we're going to go hang out with Sadie as good old Slender Arthur today and uh, have some fun. There's one thing we need to do as Slender Arthur before we go see good old Sadie Bell. And that is to collect some money from this here the woman you. now i told you i'd get you the money next week and i'll get it you... lily where's our money what give me my money what lily you took it's payday i'm sorry i don't have it right now well then <laughs> i guess we got a big problem don't we cooper give him what you've got I ain't giving him nothing. It's the bobbly it's head the that lesson. gets me every time. Well, hell no! You don't try and punch Arthur's head off. Look at the look how long my arms are. You think you can hit me? <laughs> I can hit you from I can hit you from like a mile away. Take it. <laughs> Just the way he punches like this is beautiful. All right, Lily. You about to catch these hands? You should have just given me the money, lady. Oh, the game's not letting me pimp slap you. You bad, bad woman, lady. You'll find something on him, I swear. Come here. Don't borrow no money unless you win pay it back. Take you with these elephant feet. Elephant feet? Yeah, that's what we're going with. Cooper. Wait, did she die? <gasps> she did. Oh, it's because I because I kicked her to death. <laughs> Whoops. I meant to just knock her out. There we go. We got some money. Now we can go to Tahiti. I like that he's like always gritting his teeth at this point because it makes it seem like he's just super angry about his head always bobbing back and forth. Oh, say whatever you damn well please. Stab him, I Sadie. Don't... I triple I dog dare you. I'm going to kill somebody. And if you don't stop hissing at me, I'm going to kill you. What is wrong with you two? I ain't chopping vegetables for a living. Oh, I'm sorry, madam. Was there insufficient feathers in your pillow? I ain't lazy, Mr. Morgan. I'll work, but not this. Well, I ain't cooking work. My husband and I, we shared the work. All of it. I was out in the fields. I can hunt, carry a knife, or use a gun. But I tell you, you keep me here, I'll skin this fat old coot and serve him for dinner! Watch your damn mouth, you crazy goddamn fishwife! <laughs> Enough, both of you! Well, come with me then. You want to head out there? Run with the man? <laughs> so be it. But we do more than just hunting. We're hunted. And them things hunting us, so well, they got guns of their own. I ain't afraid of dying. Good. You need anything, Mr. Pearson? Maybe me and Mrs. Zad are gonna take a little ride. Yeah, sure. Here's my list, and can you post this letter for me while you're there? Sure. Come on, princess. I kind of want to do a full playthrough with Thunder Arthur. Me, man, woman? This mutant freak is amazing. So I've graduated from chopping vegetables to shopping. Shut your goddamn mouth. Yep. Wait, we can read that letter, right? Yeah, you can actually open that letter and read it. I, I completely forgot about that. You cool down then yet? I guess. I ain't no scullion. 
And I sure as hell ain't taking orders from that sweating half-wit. I guess we all gotta do our share, Princess. Huh. Where's that letter? Are well, you reading his mail now? Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Mm. Here. <clears throat> Dear Aunt Kathy. You are something else. I haven't heard from you in some time, so I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Well, now Sadie feels blah, bad. Blah, blah. It's boring. Ooh. <laughs> Wait a sec. Listen to this. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. <laughs> <laughs> you ever actually even talk to a woman he ain't paid for? Oh, He's a savage. <laughs> and what's this? Return to Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, that. Now that's a Duchess out there. All male to be sent to the same alias. Whenever we set up somewhere new, Strauss, he heads into town. Tells him to start expecting mail from a Tacitus Kilgore, whatever they changed it to. <sighs> Here, give me that back. We got work to do. <laughs> My dad. <laughs> I just wish that characters would react Here to the way are. you look. Like sometimes so, if something gets all messed up. I shoot the shopkeeper while you... No! You insane! I thought we was outlaws. Outlaws, not idiots. We rob fools that rob other people. These people, they're just trying to get by. So you head on in there and you buy some food to eat. And no guns. You're sure? This time, there'll be time for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Nothing exciting. I gotta go bobble my head over this way. <laughs> It's just the running. Oh, sorry, doggo. The running is literally the best part ever. Uh, but if you do want to see more episodes with Slender Art, let me know in the comments below. A ton of people have been asking me to do more stuff with this particular glitch. And uh, I'd definitely be more than happy to. Can I help you, mister? Uh, yes, I would like to post a letter. All right. And mail. Perfect. Okay, no trouble. Thank you. Now we get Sadie in her nice new yellow outfit where she looking fine as day. I really wanted to do the uh, the bank robbery in Valentine as Slender Arthur, but unfortunately, I don't quite have that unlocked yet. My sister's newborn had more strength than you and he came out bright blue. I'm trying. Try harder. What you doing, girl? Are you just going to get back in the wagon? Oh, no. We got to wait for this guy to load it up. I completely forgot about that. I think this is everything. Thanks. Here. Take that for yourself, okay? Thanks. We'll give it back then. Jesus. I didn't ask for his goddamn help. Okay. Get on. I'm about done here. Why don't you drive? Okay. Come on, lady. Get a move on. I like Sadie, not Lady. I know. Yeah. All right, let's see how shooting's gonna be with this. So, you get everything? I think so. And some new clothes, I see. Don't start. I can wear what I damn well want. Like I told you, my husband and I What's shared it? all the work. I wasn't some little wife with a flower in her hair baking cherry pies all day. Yeah, I don't doubt that. You sure look the part now. Won't be long before you're smoking cigars and playing the harmonica. I'll have you know, I used to love playing the harmonica before. Well, my house and Sadie, why are you going so slow? Burned to the ground. I know. I'm real sorry about what you. What is she doing? You know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want no pity. Just treat me equal and no. Nobody's taking nothing from me ever again. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, here we go. Just don't kill the camp cook. Please. Hey there! Hey. What, uh... What you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in Lamorne Raider country. Keep it cool. You Steve. need to pay a toll to pass through here. You pay the troll toll. Oh, I don't think so. You don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Pull over? That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? Get him, Sadie. Shit. Let's get the hell out of here. Go. <laughs> <laughs> the way he holds the pistols. Oh, it's great. All right, so there's supposed to be, a, yeah, there's a trap up here. What's this guy doing? Excuse I don't remember her running somebody over. Oh God, I have no health. I completely forgot about that. Oh God. Slender Arthur has no HPs and no dead eye. <laughs> think I can't these I've never tried to duck behind anything before. Oh, it doesn't work. Okay. Told you I could shoot a gun, didn't I? Ah. Ooh, I'm about to die. Lady, I can't I duck behind anything, girl. I don't remember. Oh my god. Headshot. There we go. Now I can get behind something. Oh, I had something other than pistols. Got him. All right, so there's one guy behind us. Where are you at, mother trucker? Swiggity swooty, slend off a coming for that booty. Sleep. The <laughs> pimp slap. Perfect. Don't let anybody live, Sadie. What you doing? I wonder if we can make tiny Slender Arthur. How ridiculous would that look? Because you've caused enough trouble already. I'm fine. Yeah. We showed those bastards, huh? Remind me not to get on your bad side. And they was clearly planning to bushwhack us. You did good. But that's a lot of mess to make near camp. Hope it don't bring anyone sniffing around. Are you gonna tell Dutch? Maybe. If he asks, but maybe not. So who do they say they were? Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah, something like that. Who knows? Anyway, don't you go ribbing Pearson about that letter. How dare you? I wouldn't dream of it. Right. I hope she does. I've never seen it in the camp I conversations, but I bet she does at some no point. Small name for myself. I won't be giving you no mail to post. Anytime soon, that's for sure. <laughs> I just want to peek in that journal of yours. The mind boggles. You didn't get yourself killed then, Miss Adler. Not quite. <laughs> well, I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but I'd be lying. I, I enjoyed myself out there. Yes, we, uh, Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping? Yes, at shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe, <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well, they say I lack finesse, but I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> oh, we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High. All right, well, that was fun. I do hope you all enjoyed it. Make sure to slap that like button for Slender Arthur. Maybe his limbs will go back to normal. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you all in the next one.